day 13 of 75 hut. Today will be a slightly challenging day because my whole back has been aching, like my lats has been aching. So I couldn't do back day yesterday or I wanted to do today gym session, but I can't, I've got to recover. And I can't go to my Muay Thai training for indoors workout because I have a birthday party to attend and I have a dental appointment in the morning, so it clashes. I'll be sparring later, so that's indoor workout. But then the constraint is outdoor workout. I don't have anything planned for outdoor workout. So GG, but I'll figure something out and clutch it. Diet is still the same, steak for breakfast and dinner later and book i'll read my 48 laws of power as usual so so far i want to like speak more in the video because so far my videos has been like three minutes and four minutes so i'll yap a bit more to give you more content and something interesting so so far, how the challenge has changed my life is that it gave me a new comfort zone. Previously, my comfort zone was like just gym, just have Muay Thai training in my schedule. Like it's mandatory. But after this, after taking this challenge, I have to do like two workouts, one indoor and outdoor. So it's a new comfort zone. It forced me out of my previous comfort zone and after a while, I formed this habit of doing the two workouts, outdoor and indoors. Having the same momentum every day because it's a shriek, I can't break it. So now it's formed into a new habit, formed into a new comfort zone. And it's really helpful for whatever you do in life. Like if you want to form a new habit or like you want to challenge yourself, as seen in the way of the superior man, leave at your age or lean just beyond your age if you want to accomplish that you have to be out of your comfort zone right you can do it slowly have the momentum and then slowly slowly progressively overload like in the gym progressively overload your comfort zone your age basically and slowly you can get to where you want to be because if you just jump if you jump straight there, from like level 0 to level 100, it's a bit extreme and most people quit. So unless you want to test your willpower, your te test your age, test your limits, sure, go ahead. But you might be wasting time in the meantime, like as a result. But if you don't mind, sure, you can challenge yourself like that if you want to. And yeah. That's it. I'll show you my breakfast. By the way, I measured my height and I was like 178.5, I think. Or 178 to be safe. So I grew once a year. For breakfast, as usual, we have two steaks, which is like 650 grams of ribeye. Outdoor workout, I'm just walking round and round the park.
just did my indoors workout which is 100 inverted rows for the upper back cause my lats are still aching and right now I'll be having lunch today I'll have three meals because right now I'm not too hungry and but I have to go attend an event so I have to eat something first I have one steak like 300 to 350 grams of ribeye and uh, like two eggs and then later on I'll meal prep the other steak and maybe two eggs or so Honestly, I'll just have my second steak right now It's the end of day 13 of 75 hut for my indoor workout I did inverted rows at home and for outdoor workout I did uh, what did I I walked in the park and then I drank more than four liters of water today read 48 laws of power diet as usual strict carnivore and here's my progress picture and that's it see you tomorrow on day 14 okay bye